Hello. I am Troxvot. This is Sammy Thick Thighs. What is life without adventure? Well, it's not one worth living, in my opinion. I yearn for the unknown and the unseen. And like any good adventure, we start off on the coast. Now, Sammy Thick Thighs has earned his name and his place on this earth. He will travel and travel and travel and travel some more. And with any luck, he will find trinkets along the way. Some of which are very useful, like warmer clothes, and some of which are not useful at all. Don't know why they're here. We are complete ass in the beginning. Hungry, tired, cold, thirsty, just, just, just garbage. And of course, like the complete Chad we are, we will trade out our warm hat for a stylish boonie hat. Because if looks aren't everything in the apocalypse, you're doing it wrong. Oh great, starvation seems to be set. An apple a day will keep death away. Speaking of death, we'll stop by a medical clinic in hopes for something. Oh, yeah. Cut up some hands. Nothing, nothing, two, two, gloves, nothing, nothing, nothing. So we take our gloves and still. continue to travel. In search of better loot, we are blessed with an AK mag. Right back beside that base. We just need to simply find an AK. But first, we swap our bright red bag with a nice green tactical bag. We make our way to some military tents when we are just bombarded by a horde of zombies. One, two, graciously given two cans of food. Then we find a dropped AK that goes perfectly with our AK max. I just happen to suck with this gun. Not before long, our boy Sammy starts to look handy capable. So it's time to take a step back, eat some food, and reflect on how far we've already come. And just like Batman and Robin, I have an awesome sidekick. Yin Yang is here with me on this adventure. Fucking scare me. And he has some essential vitamins to cure the common cold. Drugged up, we travel, 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 in fashion. All this traveling has gotten Sammy's thighs quite thick, almost two C's by now. Night has fallen and we seek shelter. Cause you see that little bugger? We're starting to get tired and you see that little bugger? We're starting to get hungry. Well, a bit, I can see it. The call of an animal draws us into the radio tower and up the ladder. Yeah. Oh, that's a deer. That's a deer, yeah. And no thanks to the deer hunter game, am I a professional deer hunter. And he's dead. We skin, start a fire, cook, stuff our faces like a king. As we lay down, getting some well-needed sleep, we ponder of the world to be. We don't know what's ahead of us, but we do know this adventure has only just begun. Another and scene. as the morning sun rises, so does too Sammy Thick Thighs. We set our eyes of a sacrificial yeah, ritual another, like, site. Asleep, mm, it's done. So we travel, check the shitty okay. compass and map, and finally stumble upon some hunting campgrounds. We scavenged for loot with massive gains. What is it to walk a mile in another man's shoe? In a base that we couldn't get into. You might have I tried. Code lock and just like that, we were done with this shit place. After another shitty compass map check. North it was midday. It was time to up the ante. I wanted to see something I haven't seen before. Hello and behold, the nuclear power it's facility. I've never been here. I don't know what to expect. To be honest, it wasn't much. Hardly any zombies and hardly any loot to be had. We took shelter for the day as the sun was coming down, as we spent all day traveling and we were getting quite tired. Well, these thighs aren't gonna get any thicker by themselves. Early in the morning, we left. We still had a goal ahead of us. Remember to hydrate before your morning run and reflect on your self-reliance. After traveling all morning, we actually found ourselves at a nice military spot. After a couple of zombies, we were into the loot. 
a bigger, badder version of my AK. Clear. Some more fashion. More zombies. Take care of your things and they will take care of you. So now, with literally all of the loot, we travel again. It's like a trap. Day. Exhausted and over encumbered, we end up here at this hangar where we set up camp and get some much needed rest. Another fire and more dreams and aspirations of the world to be. We wake up and leave without even dousing the flames. Let that smoke be a signal to any survivors that we were here. And so we travel, 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 but this time it's different. It seems that we've actually made it to our destination with one small hitch. We need to be here at the stroke of midnight and bleeding to donate or sacrifice some blood. So, unfortunately, we have to sleep and rest until nightfall. Just as we were about to hunker down for a nap, a pack of rabid wolves came burling toward us. We had to handle it. One. Two, three, four, four, five, six, seven. They're out of here. With the wolves appropriately taken care of, it was now safe for us to lay down and call it a night. Alas, with night upon us, are my wishes and dreams to come true? Well, no. Not even close. Kind of like highlight. We had to wait smoke, for the stroke of midnight to do this ritual, at which time the torches would illuminate the entire ritual area. You knew, then and there, that you had to make a sacrifice for all your dreams to come true. So, as luck would have it, with so much power to behold at this area, it's no surprise that we weren't the only ones. I think he's going around my left. Yeah, oh. yeah, he's coming. Get him? I don't know. I didn't see him. Shit, he's dead. Yeah, I'm on phone. Zed. I need another player. Things aren't looking good for our boy, Sammy Thick Thighs. Guys, I just want to say part two is already being edited oh, as you guys are here. probably watching this. It might already be done editing. Um, so if you guys like this new style of content, let me know. Drop a, drop a like, drop a comment, sub, whatever. Let me know if you enjoy it. Let me know if you don't. Uh, I just wanted to try something new, you know, versus all them over the top pvps and raids just i want to bring something new to the table and i think i think this is it yeah. so thing. with that being said guys mad love and uh we'll no, see you in the next one peace done.